Hello everybody, Swami Nath here. Today we are going to see power of resume in SAP MR. Your resume is your reflection. It should be powerful. Only then you'll, your resume gets shortlisted. Let's get to the subject first. Powerful SAP MR resume summary. Your summary should be like SAP MR consultant with six years of experience in end-to-end -end implementation, support, rollout across manufacturing and retail industries. Proficient in SAP S4 HANA MM, S4 HANA MM, P2P process and inventory management. Proven ability to optimize procurement cycle, automate reporting and enhance system usability, resulting in improved operational efficiency and cost saving. So this is just a sample summary. You can use this in your resume. So very powerful. Next step. Key skills, you have to add it in your resume. Key skills, a side topic, side heading. Key skills and SAP competency. SAP MM configurations and customization. A word customization and configuration. Procure to pay cycle process. Customized procure to pay cycle. Customized inventory management, customized material master data management, customized supplier business partner, supplier business partner, SAP S4 HANA migration if applicable, supplier master, configured supplier master, customized supplier master, SAP integration with SD, FICO, WMPP, vendor management, contracts. Purchase orders, testing user training, go live support, reporting tool. If any, you have if you have worked in any of the reporting tools like SAP Fury or BA, you can specify. Activate methodology, very, very important. ASAP methodology, agile methodology, waterfall methodology. This activate methodology and ASAP methodology, activate activate methodology is for S4 HANA and ASAP methodology for ECC. A link has been provided for the description. Check the link for activate methodology. Okay, next. Professional experience. Enter the job title. Other, either you are a consultant or a senior consultant or a junior consultant. Company, location, period. A short description on the projects, on the project you have worked. And the description that is job Roles and responsibilities, configured end-to-end -end SAP modules, including procurement, inventory management, material master data, supplier master data, purchase info record data, source list, maintaining source list data, number ranges, all those are comes under customization of lead MM module integration with S4 HANA conversion project. Improving procurement process efficiency. Conduct a user training session, reducing post go live support tickets. Support MM in SAP rollout four global sites, ensuring timely deployment with within budget. Professional summary. This is a sample professional summary. If you want to use it, you can use it. Next, documentations very very important. Most of the consultants, they don't specify this documentation at all. You should be good in dog, preparing the document. Functional specification document, first one. It's very important as a functional consultant, you should be in a position to create a functional specification document. A link has been provided in the description for functional specification. Check this link, functional specification. Test case document. A link has been provided in the description. Check the link. This is the test case document. You should be in a position to create test cases also. In some projects, they may ask you to test the SAP application by the consultant. They ask the consultant to test it. They will not have a separate testing team. Instead, they have they, they just ask the consultant to test it. Unit test case document. Cheat sheets. Cheat sheets, a link has been provided in the description. Check the link. This is the cheat sheet. How to create the cheat sheet, SAPM. User manuals. Be in a position to create a user, user manuals. 
these are all the documents. Next, you can you have to specify this in the resume. This is not optional one. This is very man. This is a mandatory one. The roles and responsibilities itself you can specify this. Projects and achievements a side editing note. Conduct that workshop. Project preparation workshop. A link has been provided in the description. Check the link. Project preparation workshop. This is the project preparation. Workshop. There are many workshops like kickstart meeting workshop, planning workshop, requirement gathering workshop, design workshop, retrospective workshop, change management workshop, stakeholder alignment workshop. If there is any workshop if you are if you are involved in any of these workshops, you can. Particularly, you can specify that in the resume. Client handling and negotiation. Client meeting. A yeah, link has been provided in the description. Check this link. Two links. Client meeting. Minutes of meetings. If you would have created any minutes of meeting, long term, you can specify that in the resume. Highlight projects like SAP implementation, S4 HANA migration, automation, cost saving initiative, etc. User training. If you have given any user training, specify that in the list. Very important. Certification. This is very, very important. If you are having any certification, you can specify that. S4 HANA certification, SD or federal management, MM certification. You can specify that in the list. These are all the bullet points about the resume. Thank you.